In this YouTube script, Neville Goddard shares valuable insights about the creation process and unveils simple yet profound techniques for manifesting our desires. Drawing from his extensive experience, Neville reveals that the creation of our desires is already complete and that everything we long for already exists. To manifest our desires, Neville emphasizes the need to choose them and firmly believe that we already embody the person who possesses those desires. This highlights the significant role our thoughts and imagination play in shaping our reality. As Neville explains, the imagination represents the only true reality. To grasp this concept, Neville takes us on a journey through the depths of creation, from its inception to its culmination. He clarifies that creation is not a linear process, but rather a simultaneous one. In other words, everything we desire is already present in the quantum field of possibilities. Neville emphasizes that to manifest our desires, we must tap into this realm of possibilities through our imagination. By utilizing our imagination, we can enter a state of being where our desires have already been fulfilled. Neville refers to this state as the end. Within this state, we experience the fulfillment of our desires as if they have already materialized, and this feeling acts as a magnet, attracting our desires toward us. Neville cautions us that if we focus on lack, competition, or worry, we will attract more negative experiences into our lives. Thus, it is essential to concentrate on the reality we wish to experience and remain faithful to it through our thoughts and imagination. This necessitates letting go of limiting beliefs that hinder us and embracing the reality we desire to create. Neville provides numerous examples of individuals who have successfully used their imagination to manifest their desires. He also shares simple yet effective techniques like visualization, affirmations, and positive self-talk that allow us to tap into the power of our imagination. Neville Goddard's teachings on the creation process extend beyond mere material possessions. They encompass the manifestation of our desired reality. According to him, we can create anything we want in life by harnessing the power of our imagination. The first step involves identifying our true desires and directing our thoughts and energy toward them. This requires clarity regarding our desires and avoiding sending mixed signals to the universe. Neville stresses the importance of embodying the state of being the person who already possesses what they desire. By doing so, we live in the end and naturally attract our desires, akin to ordering an item from a catalog and knowing it's already on its way. Instead of worrying about the how, we focus solely on the end result. To embody the desired state, we employ our imagination to construct a vivid mental picture of our desired reality. This mental image must feel as real as possible. We immerse ourselves in this mental representation and evoke the emotions associated with achieving our desire. This creates a vibrational frequency that aligns us with our desires. Neville Goddard also underscores the significance of unwavering belief in the creation process. We must firmly believe that what we desire is already ours, and its manifestation in our physical reality is merely a matter of time. This belief must withstand obstacles and challenges, remaining steadfast and unshakable. Through Neville Goddard's teachings, we discover the power of our thoughts, imagination, and belief in manifesting our desires. By choosing our desires, embodying the end result, and utilizing our imagination, we align ourselves with the reality we wish to create. With unwavering belief, we become receptive to the fulfillment of our desires. These techniques extend beyond mere material possessions, allowing us to manifest our desired reality in all aspects of life. Neville believes that faith is more than just a state of mind, it is a way of being. It goes beyond positive thinking or affirming what we want. It involves embodying the feeling of already achieving our goals. When we have faith, we live as if our desires have already been fulfilled, and we attract those desires instead of chasing after them. This happens because our state of being attracts the reality we wish to experience. Neville teaches that repetition is key to developing faith. We need to impress our desires upon our subconscious mind repeatedly until they become a part of who we are. 
This means imagining ourselves already possessing our desires and experiencing the emotions associated with achieving our goals. The more we repeat this process, the stronger our faith becomes in our ability to manifest our desires. Neville also emphasizes that faith cannot be faked. Simply thinking positive thoughts and reciting affirmations without genuine belief is not enough. We must deeply believe that our desires already exist and that we are already the person who has those desires. This level of faith requires practice and patience, but the outcomes are rewarding. Furthermore, Neville sees the crucifixion of Jesus as a powerful symbol of the imagination's transformative power and our capacity to awaken to our true nature as divine beings in human form. Neville's teachings offer a distinct perspective on the law of attraction and the mind's ability to shape our reality. By understanding that everything we desire already exists and that our imagination is the key to unlocking our creative potential, we can live as if our desires have already been fulfilled and allow them to manifest. Faith plays a crucial role in this creation process. We must have faith that our desires already exist and that we are the individuals who possess them. Faith is not merely a mental state, but a way of being that enables us to live as if our desires have come to fruition and manifest them. In conclusion, Neville Goddard's teachings provide a powerful framework for understanding the creation process and manifesting our desires. By emphasizing the significance of imagination, faith, and the understanding that creation is already complete, we can live as if our desires have been fulfilled and allow them to manifest. Thank you for watching.